What's going on, guys? Wolfember Games here, and we are back on Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links. Um, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell, and comment to see, um, to just let me know what kind of cards you want to see me use. You know, um, you can always challenge me. My duelist ID is in the beginning, and my duel name is Jake Wolf. 45, you can add me. Um, this is my username up at the top. So today, we're going to be dueling with these cards. This is my Ultimate Dragons deck. So let's start with my regular field. So you got three Luster Dragons. Um, we got um, this Blue Eyes White Dragon. We got and we give and we had two of this one. Um, we also have Evil Swarms of Hack, who gets pretty powerful. Um, we have Cosmo Brain, which I'm not sure why I use Cosmo Brain. I believe it's for his high defense. Um, we run two enemy controllers in the Exit Despair, a Bingo Machine Go, a Sukaretsu Armor, two Drown and Mirror Forces. And a wall of disruption. We also have a, a white stone of legend, which I think I'm gonna get rid of. Yeah, I'm gonna get rid of that. Um, we have our pitch blade war wolf, two dragon spirits of white, a lance of lindworm, and a kid moto dragon. And then in our extra deck, we have stardust dragon, flamvel, uriquesis. Eurekwisis, um, Azurai Silver Dragon, Zabazai General, and Gagagag Samurai. Now, the Ultimate Dragon's skill um, adds all of these cards to your deck. So I can also add, go to added polymerization, I think I will, to my deck, but it also adds another Blue Eyes. It adds Blue Eyes Twin Burst, Neo Blue Eyes Ultimate, and Blue Eyes Ultimate. So, I start with like I think nine cards in my extra deck. And yeah, it also gives me a couple of different cards. Polymerization. Um which one? I'm gonna take that one because the card is in the thing. I'm going to take two, and we're going to save the deck. Let's go home. Let's go online. We're going to use the experience point booster, because why not? And we're searching for an opponent, and match successful. Let's start the duel. So even though I'm only, even though I'm only in, like, bronze, I think, people are using, like, some pretty intense cards, and I feel like it's because they're also on their road to silver. Or gold or platinum or king of games. Which honestly that's the end game, right? Okay. I'm being forced to go first. It's a bit upsetting, but I'll be alright. Hmm. I'm just gonna make him strong to just stare, have him stare down that 2850, and you mean see see what he does following that, and that and there and from there I'll see what kind of duels he is. 1200 is normal summon. He can't special summon for the rest of the turn. But something happens. Power levels at fifty percent. Okay, so he's playing a similar tactic as me. He's trying to fuse something right out of the gate. That's what I hoped I could have did, but I drew the wrong spell card. Oh no, there we go. Okay. He gains a, and he's and he's oh he he's only supposed to gain a hundred attack. And now I got my polymerization. I don't got to do as my dreams. Hmm. 
nice. Hopefully I draw blue eyes on my next turn. Because then I can do what I want. Okay, I don't, I don't think he's too experienced of a duelist. I'm going to use Polymerization and bring out Blue Eyes Twin Burst Dragon. I'm going to use two Blue Eyes White Dragons as fusion materials. Nice. And game. This is a nice turnaround from last week. All right. 4,100. Nice. And that wasn't a rank up duel. Hopefully the next one is. <clears throat> a lot of little rewards. Let's search for another opponent. Start a duel. Hopefully, this time around, I go second. That's where I work best. Facing someone from Brazil. Both using Kaiba, but two different Kaibas. Uh, I'm going first again. If I win, I'll gain rank. Okay, I'm, I'm going to confuse him a little bit. Meanwhile, I'm, I, I got to stall. That was a bad draw. And then on top of that, I was forced to go first. He's scared. Okay. So that, that, that he, he brings Fire King out. Nice. Yeah, he can destroy one monster in his hand or the monster that he controls to add Fire King to his deck and then he can special summon Fire King from his hand because he fits their criteria. What's that? I'm going to wait to see if he attacks. So what's he gonna do? Is he gonna destroy that monster and add a fire king to his hand? Cause if so, he can't use the Yes kinda shooting himself in the foot. Cause he's adding a monster to his hand. I feel like Antonio you need to get it together. Oh, you said the one from your hand to bring out uh, bring the other one from your hand, I guess. Whatever. Are you going to try to attack me? Keyword, try. Is that useful? No. I don't want to have 
Just give me. See, I know Amari because he's not using Pegasus. Pegasus can, I think one of his effects is he can see a back row, one of his skills. Okay. I was expecting that. He's either gonna send a He added a fire king to his hand and tributed one from his hand. Nice. I like that. This has become a real interesting game. Mm-hmm. They can only declare right away to take. Why? Why even summon it if what? Didn't you just add him to your hand? <sighs> I'm so confused. He about to get shuffled anyway into the deck. Well, I guess both of them getting shuffled into the deck. He gonna take both of them. Nice. Cause I didn't want him to try to take with the level eight, and then he um and and then he end up. What do you mean? Doing some crazy effect. Okay, he's adding another fire king to his hand from his deck. So, all I'm gathering from this is he has a lot of monsters. Now, this is the point where he either turns it up to 11, or he sees a duel. Either way, the duel is either over this turn or next turn. Okay. He's destroying more monsters and bringing more monsters to his hand. I thought he couldn't bring Barong back out. How many of them does he have? Uh, nice. Alright, I'm going to do... Another duel to round it out. I ranked up. Nice. You get really running down those stairs. And one more opponent. Start the duel. Okay, who and where? Who and where? Opponent data. I do not understand that name. He's from China. The bronze rank six. He's using Yugi Moto. I'm going first once again. Okay, can I stop him from ranking up? I just ranked up last duel, and I f I'm gonna feel a little bit bad, but at the same time, I'm not gonna just lose. 
Bingo machine, go. Blue eyes, blue eyes, blue eyes. I'm just going to send all left to Jack and right in there too. And I think had he sent the other blue eyes to my hand that I would have been able to get on my twin burst. But because he chose Dragon Spirit, I should have picked three blue eyes. There's two blue eyes and one Dragon Spirit. I think I might have picked two Dragon Spirits. Uh, let's attack. What does that do? Negate the attack and draw a card. Immediately after this effect resolves. You can normal summon. Oh, if it's a monster. But it wasn't a monster. It was a back row. What does he do? Special summon one dark magician from your hand. Oh, I've never seen this dark magician before. And I don't know how I special summoned him. And I guess that was all during my turn. Oh, he can't even play. Well, got nothing to lose. Nothing to lose. And I guess that negated that. Yep. Wow. I think he may or may not have won the duel. Let's see. Yeah. Yeah, you know what? I don't think I'm gonna go out like that. I think this time around we're gonna do four duels this episode. He definitely earned a nice. Let's give him the old thumbs up, and give this video the old thumbs up if you like what you're seeing. Um, yeah, I feel like I'm doing an okay job. I never claim to be the best duelist, but I always claim to be a formidable duelist. And even then, I still did a little level up. Oh, wow, they're trying to make me go to dual school because I lost the one time after I, after two very decisive victories. That's cool. It's A-OK. -okay. In the United States, Demzon. Honestly, I should have known what I was getting into last duel when I saw his YouTube name. I'm going first again, because why not <laughs> feast your eyes on this. Okay, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. That's protection. And that's just sturdy. So go back to arm roof. His job is this is when opponent's monster declares an attack, target that monster and destroy it. And this one, opponent's monster declares a direct attack, shuffle all attacks, this monster to your opponent controls into the deck. I don't know why, but I feel like he's running similar cards. And he ends his turn because he doesn't know what's in my back row. Smart. I'm going to end my turn because he still doesn't know what's in my back row. And he still is frightful of it. He only has one monster card in his hand. He has two. They are never here. 
This is turn four in the home game. Another drowning mirror force. This is asking for permission to end my turn. That means he has something slippery in his back row. Something that can either target his monster, my monster, or my back row. I'm a little intrigued. I don't know if I have anything in this deck that destroys the back row. So I think any back row trickery he has would just have to play out. Get the attack and play four height for each fish it to controls and doesn't control any. So negates the attack. That's about it. That's what I call useless. That's what I call dog water. It's boxed in. Totally boxed in. It's trash, so trash. Oh, Demzon shots. I thought it was just Demzon. He got a lot of cards over there. Two hundred for each elemental hero, so oh he jumped to eighteen hundred. Because that's the only elemental hero on the fire started at sixteen. Elemental heroes are wet. Dragons are elite. What's he tribute summoning? I don't care. I don't care at all. I don't see nothing saying that he can't be targeted by my traps. And he gonna end his turn. So generous. Oh, I like that. Bring that card. Card Start a free card. Let's go, blue eyes. Let's activate Kid Moto Dragon's effect from the graveyard. Oh, I think his monster's making me lose strength. I lose 500 for each dragon you control. You can control the one dragon, but still. I'm going to banish that one. I can't attack him yet because 2600. What was that card? He did hard. He was gonna. He could have hit another 500 and did piercing on this guy. And that would have been 2900 life points. Except for the fact that I got this. And then I got this, but this wouldn't work in that situation because it's not a direct attack, I guess. 
Okay. Is he gonna get rid of one of my? Well, he's, he's gonna try to break one of my monsters against one of my other monsters. Nope, no time to take any damage. That's out, that's dead. I don't care if I had this if I had to trigger you with my blue eyes. I let that be known. I love it when a plan comes together. Class A Joey Wheeler. So in the middle of the duel. Well, he doesn't realize that if these two attacks go through, this means the end. Nice. Real nice. Joey Wheeler. You really got out of that pinch. Let's see. No more summoning the White Stone of Ancients. This card is going to be real because it was sent there this turn. Spends only one blue eyes from his deck. You can banish this card from his graveyard, target blue eyes in his graveyard, and it hits his hand. He wants to. Get destroyed by battle because he was sent there and bring blue eyes out this turn. <laughs> Not on my watch. Nice. And that's going to do it for this week's edition of Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links. November plays Road to Silver. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share this video with anybody you know that'll like it. And if you like it yourself, um, follow me on Instagram at the G-O-D-D-A-M-N Wolf. And have a beautiful day.